shopping vlog and then after that I'm doing a whole house clean where I'll show you guys how I decorate and everything for this video today I am doing some the medication that the kids are on for their nausea gives them the runs and Sultan just had a huge accident I had to put her in the bathtub there's stuff everywhere Ugh, I'm downloading music now and the song just came out perfect time <laughs> feeling a little bit better. He's content on his beanbag with a blanket. I'm just about to upload the video. Oh my god! Oh my gosh, let me turn the AC down. It's way too loud. It's burning up outside. It's 109 degrees right now. But anyways, you guys, I didn't know where I was going with that silent intro. I just thought I would do like a pamper type of day, me day. And then I was like, mm, I actually have things to do today. So I'm taking you guys with me. First off, I got to get my nails done. They're not like terrible, but they're going back in. And I hate when they get like this. They look really bad. So going to get my nails done, run some errands. I have to go to Ruby's school to pick up a car tag for my car so I can pick her up from school. It's burning up in here. I need that AC. Let me take a quick break and get some AC in my life. When Ruby came back from her dad's house over the weekend, she immediately was like, I have a headache, I don't feel well. She started vomiting and I was like, okay, she must have a bug again. I'm going to keep the little ones away from her, but obviously they're going to play together and touch the same thing. So then the next day, Sultan woke up in the middle of the night vomiting. She had to go to the ER and then two hours later, Emir woke up vomiting. So I just knew it was going to hit me. I was praying that it wasn't, but it eventually did. It only lasted for 12 hours, which I'm grateful for because there was no way that I could be sick like that for that long again um today i'm feeling a lot better yesterday i was fine i did a lot of laundry and a lot of cleaning right now i'm taking a day for myself like i said i want to do kind of like a me day vlog but i also have errands to run i think i already said i have to go to ruby school and get a couple of cleaning supplies and other things that i need for my video coming up this week and i'm using the front facing camera because when i turn it around it just looks really bad but don't worry you guys i'm gonna get a vlog camera so i can vlog more often i know you guys like our vlogs so i like them too i love editing the vlogs and just looking back on moments like this but um yeah i'm trying to call my nail salon and nobody's picking up and i don't want to drive all the way there for nothing it's like 40 minutes away from where i live but she's the best so i have to go okay. to her i just had to stop really quick and make sure that the car vibrating wasn't really really loud and i hope for you guys that wear headphones don't hear it too much but it's a vlog it's real life so it's going to be kind of all over the place and noisy at times so bunker down I'll charge my phone before i go I have a long way to go i think i'm just gonna go and see what happens and if i have to come back later i'll just do my errands and then get ruby and drop her off and come back later it's that serious you guys like i have to go to her i've tried going to other salons and it just doesn't work so yeah um 
that's pretty much it. <laughs> so then Aline left in my house shoes. Oh my god. Okay, so I tried calling a couple of times before I got here and nobody was picking up. So I just walked in and she's not going to be ready for me until 4 p.m. And it's 1.33 right now. So I'm going to go get my errands done and go to Ruby school and then come back, which is going to be... Driving back here at this time is going to be crazy traffic. She said between 4 and 4.40, so I have like three hours to kill. done getting my nails I picked Ruby up from school and then I just hung out at home for a little bit but let me show you guys my toes oh lord we're gonna be here forever <laughs> so my fingernails look nothing like the color on my toes oh this is bad lighting mm, I'll show you when I get home okay I'm home so hopefully the lighting is better out here I got like a peachy pink there's still some like stuff under my nail from just the process but these are my real nails with dip on top and my toes are like this baby pink color i thought they were going to be the same color but who cares as long as they're manicured and look nice it's way later in the evening now this is when i start my nighttime skincare routine so i decided to add it in since i showed you guys a little bit of my morning routine some of the products are the same except for my vanity planet spin brush i like to use it whenever i wear makeup all day like today the ultimate skin spa comes with three different attachment heads a daily clean brush an exfoliating brush and a silicone brush all of the brushes on each are super soft and gentle on the skin. On days that I don't wear makeup, I use the silicone brush head, which I really like because it's quick drying, non-porous silicone that resists bacteria buildup. First, I'm using organic coconut oil as a makeup remover with just some regular baby wipes that we already buy in bulk. No need to buy separate makeup wipes. I've heard coconut oil can actually make you break out, but I've never experienced that. I do want to try the Drunk Elephant Cleansing Balm since Haley mentioned it in one of her videos. I've heard really good things about that brand and it's well rated on Sephora. I think I'm going to give a few things a try. I brought my little stool in from my vanity to sit in the bathroom to make it more relaxing. I love pampering myself. Self-care is way more fun and beneficial to me than anything else. And even more so lately, it always makes me feel better. It's 
Tonight, I'm using my exfoliating brush to give my skin a deep clean. Honestly, after I use this with my daily cleanser, my skin is super soft and clean. I definitely notice a glow right after my first time using it, and it's been about a month now. I'll have a link in my description and a 70% off discount code for you guys if you want to try the ultimate skin spa for yourself. Just put in JT Glows at checkout. By the way, all of my hand towels were in the wash. Normally, I'd have a fresh one in here, but as you guys saw at the beginning of the vlog, literally every towel and hand towel was soiled. I'm using Q-tips dipped in a little bit of coconut oil to get the rest of my eye makeup off. I don't like to wipe over and over with a wipe under my eyes, so whatever is left, I gently wipe off throughout the process. This Glam Glow Mask is one of my favorites from the line. It cools and tightens while it dries. It kind of smells like a minty licorice to me. I always get the mini size ones and it lasts me about four masks. I never buy the big ones because it's expensive and I like to have a variety. My Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask is one of my favorites. I use it every single night and it lasts forever. I'm also using my Tarte Pack Your Bags Eye Mask. I repurchase these all the time. They're my favorite. Sometimes while I wait for my mask to dry, I go ahead and clean up the kitchen and the living areas, but today I sat in the bathroom and played games on my phone. The kids were already asleep and I thought, eh, that can wait until tomorrow. I'm enjoying myself. Open eye, feel the waves cut through me, hypnotized. By the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Chemicals collide Hold tight hold If you guys want me to do a detailed nighttime skincare routine, let me know and I will definitely film that. Now I'm going in with the same products that I showed you earlier in the video, except for my Rose Quartz Roller. I think that's what it's called. I have a green one also. I know that one's Jade. This actually should be in the fridge, in my skincare fridge, to keep it really, really cold. But honestly, it stays so cold on its own, and this feels so good and relaxing. So I thought it was done here and then I remembered the star of the show girl, my bonnet. I don't go to sleep without this on my head. It keeps my hair smooth and prevents it from drying out overnight. Can't nobody tell me nothing. I love my bonnet. Hey guys, I just wanted to come on really quick and say that it's another day and I'm on my way to pick Ruby up from school. I'm actually late. I have to hurry up and get out of here. And then we're going to Sam's Club and Target. It's raining like crazy. Ugh, story of my life, raining while trying to do errands with the kids. We stopped at McDonald's to get some french fries because Ruby was starving. She said the lunch was disgusting at school today, so. Yeah. Well, Normally I would be packing her lunch, but we're low on groceries yet again. So we're going to Sam's Club and Target. I think I already said that when I told you guys that it was another day, but anyways. Boop boop. Hi, sweetness. Ruby's filling up his cup. Mommy has to clean the car. There's crumbs. All of Emir's shoes are in here on the floor. Can you guys tell he always kicks his shoes off when we're in the car? Never fails. I look really weird with my sweater and my shirt on, but it's raining like crazy, you guys. I didn't vlog at all in Target because I was just there recently and I vlogged, so I was just grabbing a couple of things. I'll show you guys what I got when we get home and what. They got more LOLs. These girls are crazy about LOLs it's and collecting them. It's big sisters. It's like, it's like if the babies were Bubuk and then it's Sultan for the, this one and then the big sisters are like me. Yes. So that's what they got. And then the Bubuk brother. was going to, or Emir, he was going to get some little cars that he picked up. But when we got to the checkout, he didn't want them. He obviously wanted candy and started screaming. So... You guys already know how that goes. I saw one of my nurses from my other school. Oh yeah, when we were outside Target, someone said, hey Ruby, and I'm like, 
what? And then we noticed that it was the nurse from her old school. She's really sweet. I'm like, I was confused for a second. I'm like, oh, it's <laughs> What was that? Her LOL. Wait, let me oh, see. thought it was a water bottle. And let me try to This yeah. is our little LOL that they're excited about. We'll show you the one that I got when we get home. Yeah. Oh, you guys keep asking me about my it's all blown out now it looks crazy it's blown out but this book bag is from the Tory Burch website I bought it about two months ago and I checked yesterday because I keep getting questions about it and it's not on there anymore so I don't know you guys I really love this book bag though don't open it please uh oh she's just gonna open it now perfect zip these girls where do I put it Emir is falling asleep sweetness you're tired, aren't you, buddy? Look at the wrapper inside. It's all silver and glittery. That's actually oh. really cool. Guys, look at how adorable this it. thing is. The hair is all glittery. I Everything like this one. Glittery. There was so much cute stuff at the dollar section. I really wish that I was a teacher. There is some cute stuff in there. Oh my goodness. You would be my teacher. You would be the best teacher. Oh, thanks, Ruby. I yeah. did teach you guys at home for a little while, but then you guys are off to school, and it's sad. Sultan's gonna be starting her first day of school soon. Friday. She missed Friday. She missed I'm a lot of days. Now. Yay! So worried. Now you're not worried anymore. No. She I'm missed a big girl. She missed a couple of days because she's been sick. She's honestly been in a diaper because I was just dealing with so many accidents, like so many accidents. So. She's been in a diaper since then. I just couldn't deal with it anymore. So I'm gonna have to not sit with my friend. Yeah, Ruby's gonna have to sit with her sister when it's time to get picked up. I can only see my friend at recess. Yeah, that's okay, that's fine. Yeah. Once you guys get together, just call me and I'll be there in that huge long line waiting 45 minutes to pick you guys up. They have to do something about that. It was, I'm like, where are they? <laughs> we were there, we were in line. I will talk to you guys when we get home. This is what we got from Target. I got these two uniform dresses for the girls. We saw them online and the girls love them. So I picked two of them up, one for Sultan and one for Ruby. They're the Cat and Jack brand. I also got a skirt. This one is not like the ones we got from Old Navy. It's a stretchier, softer material than the ones that we got from Old Navy. This is also the Cat and Jack brand. I got one for Ruby also, but she wanted to wear it to school today, so I washed it last night so she could wear it. Sultan had to get a different lunch box because her bento box is not gonna fit into her circle LOL one. So she'll just use that one for home or just like, I don't know, she'll probably just end up putting toys in it and carrying it around the house. But this is really cute. I like the color, of course, and there's a little side pocket for her water bottle. I cannot believe she's gonna be starting school soon. I got two pajama sets for myself. They're like this really soft, I call them jiggly. They're like that jiggly soft material. And I got a gray one also. You guys, I went to put on that dress, was it yesterday or the day before? And I realized I didn't have any regular bras or decent underwear to wear under that dress. So I picked some up. I'm not gonna like go through it. It's just, it's there. Oh, and the underwear is five for 20 right now at Target. I think it's always like that, but they have some cute colors. And I almost forgot. I got a cleaning caddy, finally. They only had gray or else I would have got white. I'm from school, looking all cute in her skirt. I love it, in your van. Oh, it's windy. Oh, sorry. Somebody's waiting for us across the street. I'm a YouTuber, excuse me. We have lots of stuff for lunch boxes. Oh. Yeah. This little boy is going to be starting school soon. We just got back from the school and grocery shopping. Sultan is registered and ready to go to school tomorrow. And Emir is going to be ready to go to school by Monday. They're all going to be at the same school, which is super convenient. These little active wear sets that I get from Sam's Club for the kids 
are like two dollars right now like two dollars a piece i showed you guys a little bit in the video i'm just quickly showing you guys like some of the stuff that we got i'm about to end the vlog we are starting school tomorrow it's super dark in here ruby is excited her sister's gonna be in the same school as her that's really cool and you guys have all matching outfits mm -hmm. <laughs> but my shirt is different from my shirt yeah, it's the dry fit one for when it's hot outside. And I got a skirt. My first day wearing a skirt to school for uniform. Yep, super cute. These are the lunch boxes that I chose for the girls. Oh, I need the red They're like this bento. Can you open it up, Rube? Oh, whoa, that was loud. <gasps> this is what it looks like inside. I showed these on Instagram. <laughs> and um, they had really good reviews on Amazon, so I went with these. What would you put in here? That's where you guys' treats are gonna go. I'm gonna put the treats in the little circle every day. This one is for Sultan. It looks exactly the same on the inside. Sultan, you gotta practice opening your one up, baby. This is the little, the big sister that Ruby got last yes, night. Last night, and this is the one that Sultan got. I can't talk. I'm tired. I have a meal lot prep. going on. I can't film my meal prep video tonight like I planned. I have to wash Sultan's hair, get it all detangled, and ready for school tomorrow. There's like so much going on right now, you guys, but. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I will talk to you all in the next vlog. I was going to say in my next video, but that sounds like I'm ending a cleaning video. So I will talk to you guys in the next vlog. I already ended the vlog, so... Bye, guys. Say bye. Bye.